Tesla Model Y and Model 3 vehicles may very soon run on new batteries with a longer range because Tesla supplier Cattle announced a new battery with 403 miles of range. Cattle announced this new battery at a prestigious congress in Beijing, saying that it expects the new battery to have increased energy density by 10 to 20 percent. Now, let me tell you about the details of this announcement and what it means for future Tesla cars charging times and details. Welcome back everyone. This is Armin Haryan from torquenews.com. Please like this video if you find the information useful and helpful and subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news, please. So Chairman Zheng Yukun of Tesla Battery Supplier Contemporary Amperex Technology Limited, better known as Cattle, discussed the company's new M3P battery at the World New Energy Vehicle Congress in Beijing last week. This is a very big and prestigious Congress. Cattle expects M3P batteries to have increased range of density by 10 to 20 percent. With the M3P battery, cattle cells could increase an electric vehicle's range to 700 kilometers or 430 miles. M3P batteries will be made from new materials that cattle states will lower the cost of the cells compared to nickel and cobalt based batteries. So there are a couple of good things here. First, there is no cobalt, there is no nickel, and the cost of these new batteries is going to be lower, which is very important when we're going to talk about the price per kilowatt hour. Now, before I go any further along these lines for a moment, I want to tell you something very important, friends, when you hear reports about new electric cars uh, batteries that companies announced and their increased range. I'm telling this to you so you know what information to look for and go, uh, and go beyond the announcements that companies usually make. To increase the electric vehicle's battery range, you need to simply increase the size of the battery. So range means nothing here when they say we will have new battery with bigger range. Well, maybe you just increase the size of the battery. That's why you have it in the bigger range. We need to know some other numbers to find out how good this new battery is and how good it will be for other electric cars as well as Tesla. Um, for example, the kilowatt hour per kilogram. How many kilowatt hours this battery provides per kilogram? Or we need to know this battery's charging time, how fast this battery will charge and how durable and the longer cycle it will have. We also need the US dollar pricing per kilowatt hour. For example, we know that $100 per kilowatt hour is the parity level with gas cars. So will this be lower than $100 per kilowatt hour? If yes, then it's very good. These are very important specs to know in about batteries in order to understand how good a battery is. Um, Dave Wright, for example, Cattle expects M3P batteries to have increased energy density by 10 to 20 percent. So this must probably mean that 10 to percent, 10 to 20 percent increase in kilowatt hour per kilogram. Hopefully so. Anyway, Cattle says something very important important that these batteries will lower the cost and they will not use nickel or cobalt which are very important because mining keep nickel or cobalt has come with child labor and very questionable technique. So this is the good news. Scale of a battery production is also an important metric as well. Such batteries need to be produced at huge scale to have any relevance to the market. Although knowing cattle's capacity, resources, and experience, I would think this Tesla battery supplier will not have problems scaling the production of these M3P batteries. Cattle aims to increase its lead over its rivals like LG Energy Solutions and BYD. The M3P battery cell might help the Chinese battery supplier achieve these goals because if you have batteries, better batteries, lower cost and bigger range and so on, and with other techniques that uh, specs that I just mentioned, that means you have a good chance to um, increase your lead over your uh, rivals. Now imagine M3P batteries with longer range in Tesla Giga Shanghai cars. Early last month in August, rumors floated around in China that Tesla Giga Shanghai would launch new Model 3 and Model Y variants with Cattle's M3P batteries. Currently, Giga Shanghai vehicles use Cattle's lithium phosphate batteries. As of this reporting, Tesla China's website states that Model 3 has cruising range between 556 kilometers, which is 345 miles, and 675 kilometers, which is 400. 
19 miles based on the China light duty vehicle test cycle. It's called CLTC standard. CLTC estimates are usually higher than WLTP and MNEDC numbers in Europe. So uh, Chinese standards are usually higher than the European uh, range standards. The MIC Model Y, made in China Model Y, has a cruising range between 338 miles to 410 miles according to CLTC. Now, if cattle is going to provide new battery with 430 miles, we will, may soon see a new variant of Tesla Model Y with this longer range. How soon this will come depends on how soon cattle will get to the production of this battery, of course. Now, you know one thing that's important to know is China uh, is improving battery supply chain. That's very important. Representatives of the 2022 World New Energy Vehicle Congress in Beijing brought up concerns about emissions from manufacturing plants and the rising cost of raw materials during the event because battery manufacturing comes with lots of emissions. And also we see that the cost of battery materials are rising as well. So how do you keep the battery cost lower? Now, according to Bloomberg, executives at the conference encouraged the Chinese government to follow international emission standards Reg uh, regarding local manufacturing processes. Cattle chairman Zheng noted that China lagged behind other countries regarding emissions from manufacturers. The representatives suggested that the Chinese government invest more in low energy consumption products and encourage companies to upgrade production facilities to improve emissions. They also mentioned the idea of establishing an up-to-date carbon emission database. Representatives also talked about rising raw material costs. For example, uh, Chairman Chen Kong said, we are all working for the mines, said Psych Motor Corporate uh, Chairman Chen Kong. Car makers worldwide have increased their product, uh, products prices due to rising raw material and logistics costs. Top electric vehicle maker Tesla, for example, has been affected as well. Executives at the 2022 World New Energy Vehicle Congress suggested that China further develops battery recycling businesses to combat some raw material costs affecting car makers. In any case, I hope to see more information about these new batteries. I hope this is a good step forward resulting in electric vehicles or new Tesla models with longer range and faster charging time. I also take it this is for LFP type battery. No? I don't know. If you know what type of battery this is probably going to be, friends, let me know in the comment sec uh, section. Um, uh, because let me know your opinion in general about these new cattle batteries with long range and if they are for LFP type. Now, in case you don't know much about the LFP type batteries, the lithium iron phosphate battery or LFP battery is a type of lithium ion battery using lithium iron phosphate as the cathode material and a graffiti graphic carbon electrode with a metallic backing as the anode. The energy density of an LFP battery is lower than of the other common lithium ion batteries battery types such as nickel manganese cobalt and nickel cobalt uh, allurium and also has a lower operating voltage. Cattle's LFP batteries are currently at 125 watt hour per kilogram or to possibly 160 watt hour per kilogram with improved packing technology while BYD's LFP batteries are at 150 kilogram compared to over 300 watt hour kilogram for the highest NMC batteries. No uh, notably, the energy density of Panasonic's 2170 NCA batteries used in Tesla Model 3 is around 260 watt hour per kilogram, which is 70% of its pure chemical value. Because of its lower cost, higher safety, low toxicity, long cycle life, and other factors, LFP batteries are finding a number of roles in electric vehicle use, utility scale stationary applications, and backup power. LFP batteries are cobalt free. Uh, as of quarter one 2021, LFP type battery market share has reached 24.1% with Chinese manufacturers holding a near monopoly and is expected to rise further to surpass the regularly known batteries, NMC type batteries, in 2028. 
So what do you think about this new Cattle battery? Cattle is a major Tesla supplier. This is, uh, this is going to be called M3P battery. Let me know your thoughts, friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Uh, please like this video if you found the information helpful. Subscribe to our channel. Ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. And look forward for my next Tesla story in a few hours.